the secrets. The secrets that the pro Dead Cells players don't want you to know about. This is like, uh, who remembers breaking the magician's code? The program that was on, I think it was on ABC to be honest. Um, I think I can actually spin here. And just grind up. Oh my god, I couldn't. Crap. I was too greedy. I knew I shouldn't have done it. I knew I shouldn't have done it. And the only thing that will give you that is... The combo. But here's to like, not dying to the curse. If I can ask this game for one thing today, it's not dying to this curse I have. Just let me play. Like, I should be allowed to play. Oh my goodness, and we have bonus cells with the syringe. Crap, I should have waited until I cleared the curse. Don't go down there. Four more. I know I'm being like wicked careful here. But these enemies can be like really, really bad. We'll just go for the parry. There we go. Alright, let's spin. Nice elite, by the way. Oh, wow. Crap. I stopped spinning. Okay, my bad. I keep making that mistake where I think... I need the money. Where I think we're spinning. That's not red. Wow. I need all these cells. Just grind them up. Oh wow, we reached the bottom. Wow, you're actually immune to stun during this. That's... That's low-key kind of sick. Like, you can actually helicopter all the way down. And it is perfectly legal. Perfect landing at the very bottom. See, now, like I said, the only real problem with this... Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, we're good. I can make this. No problem at all. Perfect item. I'm getting lifesteal off this. What happens when you reach collector was you gotta forfeit the item. I'm... I think I'm lifestealing off this. Are you telling me this counts as melee? Because that's like... Kinda interesting. Think you should upload a BC farm to YouTube on 1BC? We... Oh, you're right. So, Examine, I actually have a... A cell farm. But you are correct, it's on 4BC. So, I don't have one for the lower divisions. You're right about that. That doesn't mean we can't. So definitely thank you for that feedback. Let's 
drag this up. I want to spin so bad. I really do. There we go. Alright, let's fight the elite. Oh, get panned. <laughs> Peach is back. Forfeit? Did I say forfeit for um the collector? Cause that's probably what I meant. Like yeah, you gotta forfeit the syringe. When you get to the collector. 100 percent correct. Alright, we're spinning. <laughs> the new cell farming right here. As you're actually paying cells. Gonna go to sleep, are you, Kellen? Thanks for staying up. I know it's way, way late for you. Please. Freaking dead ends. 5 a.m. Oh my goodness gracious. Yeah, definitely have a good night. Another curse. This is actually slowing us down, which is kind of interesting. I feel like spinning while cursed. Tasumaki Senpukyaku. Uh, oh my god, I cannot think of what that could possibly be. <laughs> Confirmed anime fraud. How in the world does V not know the Tatsumaki? No, that's... Yeah, I was gonna say that's Spin Kick. As soon as I said anime, I was like, wait, that's not anime at all. That's Ryu. See, and <laughs> almost got me. Okay, time to spin. See, you definitely heal. This thing's 100% melee. Look at that. Ugh. Freaking dead ends. <laughs> yes, yeah, Sonic. I. It took me a lot. A lot to get that. Hey, how you doing, Ventus? Ventus, you're just in time. We're spinning. Commence the spinning. Someone get me, like, 30 minutes of that. Oh, wow. He got me out. 30 minutes of that character, like that toy from Aqua Team Hunger Force. Doing the, the jiggling? I forget what it actually was. Wow. Let me up. I need 30 minutes of jiggling. And we'll use it every time we actually get syringe. No troll. I didn't load it up. I'm gonna wait the 15 seconds. What's that spin thing? This is the newest weapon in the... In the latest patch. Patch 1.4. We're playing the beta. So it's almost live. And this is one of the newest weapons, which is apparently, like, super fun. Or so I hear. I'm being told that this is a fun weapon of some sort. Look at this. Look at me just outplay that monster. <laughs> I'm 
no counterplay. How am I? I'm doing real well as long as I'm spinning. I'm doing great. Only thing is, you like can't go up. It's kind of lame. You need a color, colorless one. Oh, for hunters, I think it might be melee shack. I'm really, really thinking it's melee. So, do you need hunters or killer instinct? It ha so obviously you don't reduce the cooldown while you're mid spin because it's not on cooldown. Wow, that looks fun. I want a legendary boomerang with ammo plus one. Wait. Yo. Welcome back. Boomerang's a back, baby. You can't keep him down. Okay. You go combo. Frenzy. And I guess it's Berserk. Like, if this thing actually counts as melee, you can go berserk and not care about getting hit ever. Because you're never gonna be affected by malaise. Got the legendary. Never before seen. Chat knows it, chat loves it. The double boomerang. It is beautiful. We love it every time we see it. And we're taking it because you gotta. Like, how on earth do you pass double ammo boomerang in 2019? You can't. You just can't. We could possibly even cheese the fight, but I don't think I will. Wait, am I doing no damage? <laughs> Hang on, where's where's the damage at? jumping over me like I do want to actually parry him but he like doesn't want to be parried look at that is that the bait huh yo we got a easy money right here oh wow dude okay so um, there are some people who haven't seen version 1.4, so I do want to show you all what this looks like. This is another new item. It's called Light Speed, just like Sonic the Hedgehog does. So what it is, it's a dash. And then you can actually dash backward. So it's on a cooldown. It's relatively short. Um, it is both red and purple. So if you're playing Brutality, you can be Shadow the Hedgehog. If you're playing Tactics, you can be Blaze. Blaze is purple. Wait, so is Boomerang a special case with two times ammo? It can only be two times when it's legendary. So that's why if you see a legendary Boomerang, you should really consider taking it. Just don't pay a lot of money on the resets because it can bait you really badly and like wasting all your money uh, but when you do see the dubs on it it's pretty legit all right we're spinning how do i go up 
Okay. So there is a double jump. More like a wall jump. Dude, this is... This is, like, illegal right here. Yeah, it has to be legendary. Ooh. This... I'm gonna, like, die on bo- No. Hmm. Would I die on bosses if I take this? I think if I replace my shield with a melee weapon, we'll be fine. Or if I replace it with, like, ice shards, that'll be okay, too. Corrupted power. With boomerangs is a thing. Like, we were doing that back in 2000... <laughs> 2012. This is a, a vintage build right here. Whoa. How did I not die? <laughs> I don't think I deserve to live just then. All right, we're spinning. Oh no, you can't corrupt it power during it. Oh no. I should honestly just leave. Man. Crap. Did I sell it? It's fine. I'm gonna use the health pot, I think. Maybe not. Can I use double ammo mutation with the L? I wanna say no. It specifically says ammo mutation doesn't apply to the item. So that was a new thing that they did. I don't know if it still worked in the past. See, I actually have Berserk running. That's kind of disgusting. So all you need is like one kill. And you won't be affected by malaise. You just keep spinning. Yeah, I did it just then. The corrupted power lasted for like two seconds. And now we have to wait. Feels bad. Wow. Like, get out of here with that. Not playing. See, no malaise. Of course, you can't get a V.60 like this, ever. But no malaise. How is that the syringe goes on forever? I'm actually feeding it cells. White. I have eight, no, I have 235 cells, and they all go to this syringe. Every one of them. All right, can I spin now? Oh, wow. Ow. The boomerang. I'm so used to just destroying everything with the boomerang. I'm not used to actually having to try. It's a regular chest. I can't get up there. Dang it! 
All right. You got me, game. Yeah, and I still think Boomerang's good. I just need a second thing to throw, to be honest. Specifically for bosses. Like, I can't just do this. Ow. Worth. Twins. Just keep jumping. Just keep spinning. They can't hurt you. Okay, how do I get up there without, like, not spinning? Well, without stopping my spin. <sighs> this rocket science right here. Let me up! Oh, we made it. This is great! Look at that! Why is this a melee weapon? Can you want to explain that to me? Oh, get me up there. I don't think I can make it. No! Is there another way? No. Jeez. My momentum. That life gain? No, this is a sick weapon. This weapon's nasty. <laughs> I'm about to die to like having full malaise, by the way. Wow. That's nice. That is lovely. I just want to spin. Oh, these leeches. I hate these leeches. They can all die to the spin. Oh, I thought we were done with curses. Huh. I actually might take this curse into the next map. I don't particularly want to be on this map for any longer. Even though we're really close to a V.60. Oh, there's two scrolls. Wow. Ideally, I would like to just clear this in Sepulcher. No, no, no. Look oh, I'm so sorry, Ventus. I actually missed uh, what you typed there. So thank you for responding to that, Shaq. How do you get good at this game? I mean, if you look, Ventus... We got hours in this game. So what you're seeing right now is just like embedded in my brain. Like at this point, and again, I'm not even at like the highest hours compared to some people. Some people like are a thousand. Imagine playing Dead Cells for a thousand hours. I mean, that's probably like really fun, but imagine having a thousand hours in Dead Cells. I'm at like 700. And this is already like kind of insane. How about... No, I don't want to pay the money. We're just going to leave. I don't really care about the V.60.
Like, unless it's another syringe, I don't think I would take it. Only thing I would probably take is, like, a firebrand. Alright, let's reroll this. Try to get some red. Oh, whoops. Crap. Buster was blocking. But yeah, Shaq. How to get good at the game. So first off, we have a ton of ammo. That's the first thing. The second thing is that... We... Die a lot. And we're dying not because, like, we don't know what's going on. Like, we're trying stuff that might be slightly unnecessary. And I feel like that kind of stuff is what's actually kind of keeping us in the game. Because it gives you some insight into what... And maybe that's what, like, an intermediate guide video could help with, but... I think number one is just hours. Straight hours of dead cells. More hours than a normal human should ever be doing. 1BC is where the game gets real. Honestly, by the time you get used to one, you'll probably start feeling way better about it. Zero is a little too easy at the moment. 1BC is actually fun. I agree. Like, I think the most fun difficulties, in my opinion, are one and three. Like, if you just want to have a good time, that's where you go. I don't want to spend... No, I can probably spend here. I can't beat that job. Oh, wow. Oh, no. You actually have to climb on this map? It's kind of weak. That's an elite. <laughs> About face. Oh, wow. Two without a lot of stuff unlocked feels roughest. I 100% agree. I think 2BC is like the hardest difficulty. Then again, like, I just really struggle on that place. No, 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 no. I really struggle. Ventus with the follow. Welcome, Ventus. Yeah. Get in games. Also, Daily Challenge, by the way. Daily Challenge helps you learn certain monsters that you don't typically see. Hello. Keep the owl out while you spin. I just paid $50,000 for that corrupted power, by the way. I have no money. Wow, I actually have to contest the elite. One and three were hardest. Two and three were the absolute hardest. Tough to say which one's worse. I gotta think of like how I actually want to do this. I really want to just aggro it and jump down, assuming it doesn't have box. Looks like it's twins. Yeah, okay. Hey, how you doing, Black Robe? Meet up, Black Robe. How you doing today? I'm sorry, like, I'm still not used to chat actually moving, so I do sometimes have to pause just to catch up on chat. 50 to 70 hours on those two difficulties. I... I think that's my 2BC, to be honest. You were about to stop, but it's nice to hear that it gets easier on 4 and 5. Not that it gets easier, I would say. Um, definitely, yeah, the updates help. Commence the spinning. The updates definitely help. Oh, are we stuck? Okay, we're out. Oh. 
dead ends everywhere. Um, but to me, it's still like once you're playing 4BC for a while and start to understand like what's strong, what works well with other things, it actually becomes conceptually easier. Not that the game's actually easier in 4BC, but just like the concepts. So you start to understand the game a little easier. It's still really hard. But like you don't make as many bad choices, I guess. Because <laughs> you're not allowed to make a lot of bad choices. I've been making some bad choices today. Shoot, I'm about to make another bad choice real soon. <laughs> just to say that. Frank could easily beat 4BC back in pre-release, but can't do it anymore. Yeah, the teleportation is a big thing. That's different. Oh. Mm. Commence the spinning. Oh no, the... So you can't actually activate the owl mid-spin. It actually cancels you. Interesting. You're doing great, Black Roll. That's good to hear. <laughs> Not gonna lie, Black Robe, I still need to register. I was waiting with my buddy who I went with last year. But he just bought a house, so he actually can't. Like, and by, like, just bought a house, I mean he literally just bought a house. So we're probably gonna be going, um, me and the wife. Coach Mosh. Uh, okay. Hmm. Apparently this map is kind of tough with Syringe. Try to parry. Oh, I have to actually open it. That's probably not smart. There we go. Okay. We're chilling. After unlocking, everything cells are useless. So, apparently not, because we're actually using cells right now. I guess, like, literally, like in the literal sense, we are using cells right now. Do we need cells? Probably not. But we're, we're using them. That's all. Uh, let's do this. Am I good at this game? If so, how do you get good? You spin. Whatever, whatever you need to do, Rar, you spin. You see an elite, spin. You curse, spin. You hungry, <laughs> just start spinning. That's all I'm doing. I'm pressing R2. And... I mean, technically I could still die. I'm cursed. So I'm still trying to be careful. Uh, but like, to be 100% serious, I'm a big fan of daily challenge. Like, I know a lot of people don't like daily challenge because they don't want to go for leaderboard. But in all honesty, daily challenge is some of the most like low pressure practice environment you could possibly ask for. <sighs> My gosh. The dead ends in this place. So Daily Challenge teaches you about certain monsters. It helps you learn how to fight Concierge more. Need light? Thank you, game. Really? Who threw that? 
There's like nothing even here. Oh, wow. Imagine getting that while you're spinning. Uh, you never thought about dailies as real practice, but it's not a bad idea. Yeah, and the monsters really don't hurt you at all. So like I said, it's a low pressure environment because it doesn't matter if you get hit. It doesn't matter if you lose. The more you lose, like the more you get to like learn how you die. And daily challenge that is. Double jump. So we're actually gonna take this just for the bot just for the challenge room. So that way we can get the extra jumps. And then when you leave the room, you'll actually have your necklace back. So there's a little tip today. The necklace that you pick up, if you leave the other one, the other one does pop out at the very end. Jeez. How's that happen, chat? We were right there at the door. And now we have our amulet back. Okay. Um... We're almost at the end. I'm actually gonna stay up just a little bit longer. Airless isn't home yet, so I'm not doing anything special. Oh, I didn't activate my owl. I'm gonna wait the 20 seconds, because this seems like it's actually kind of decent. It's having the owl and the Garen spin. And cats, apparently. River's been on my desk this entire time. Ah, there we go. I was about to say, I know I can make that. I can't make that, though. <laughs> Double damage grapple hook. Not bad, not bad. Is this a modded run? I know it looks awfully modded right now. Like, I know some of this does not look legal, but no. <clears throat> no, this is normals. We are actually playing norms right now. I don't think I can take the sandals. <laughs> Garen plus Yumi. Actually disgusting. Holy moly. Exo's right. How do we not see this sooner? Oh, here's the ultimate test. Oh my god. Because this thing actually makes you faster. So it's like kind of awkward stutter stepping like that. Look at this. I need light though. There we go. I see the light. <sighs> made it. We made it chat. <laughs> I almost have all my health back. Okay, we got her. I think we might have to report that this thing should not be melee. Maybe. I feel like it's strong. And being melee is probably unnecessary. If that's like not unreasonable to say. Yeah, 1.4 beta. That is correct. Thank you, Bob. So once this is live to like consoles and stuff like that, you will be able to spin too. You just have to beat um, some enemies. <sighs> Get me up there. Ooh, we made it. Oh, we got a V.60 situation chat. 
If I can get a V.60 in the chat. Oh, you can even open that? Wow. Can I see the little homies? Ow. Okay. That ain't right. <laughs> Only a couple enemies, exactly. No pressure. Man. Hmm. Yeah, damage. I think it has to be nerfed. I don't think this can be melee. The lifesteal that you get off of this thing is kind of nasty. Incredible rally potential. Should I take this into Timekeeper? What do you all think? Timekeeper or Giant? I think we should go Giant, to be quite honest. I think Timekeeper would be super easy with a weapon like this, but I'm really curious on the Giant. Giant would be way harder? Yeah, it would be. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it would be. Imagine him just punching you, and you can't roll because you're gonna cancel your your roll. I mean, you're gonna cancel your spin. I kind of think we do giant. I'm okay with dying. I'm really okay with dying. Is two boys X great? A lot of people do like double boy, the double oh, young man. Oh, look at that damage. Lucifer, follow the channel. Welcome. Glad to have you here. Hope you enjoy. Again, thank you everyone for tuning in tonight. I'm having a lot of fun. We're spinning. Commence. Okay. You're currently stuck on 2PC. Any tips for the timekeeper? What if you do giant? Blue well. How would you feel about not going timekeeper and going giant instead? Imagine if TK hooks you while you're spinning in her face, busted. I'm telling you, I think Timekeeper's too easy for this build. Like, I'm not, I'm not talking about Blue Whale. I'm not saying Timekeeper's too easy, so don't worry about it. For you specifically, Blue Whale, what if you tried a couple nights of Giant instead? No Timekeeper. Like, ban Timekeeper for like a week. And then... Once you've done giant a couple times, then go back to Timekeeper and see if it feels any better. I'm so sorry, chat. I really am. But we have to test this. So in my opinion, some of the right builds just completely destroy the giant. That's super greedy. But some of the right builds really, really destroy the giant. And yeah, they can also destroy Timekeeper for the most part. But in some cases... You will, like, the giant will not even be able to act. Okay, so... I want to say... We don't need combo anymore. So the build now is still Frenzy. Berserker. Vengeance. I'm sorry, Exo. I, I could have gone Timekeeper, but we need to test this thing to the full absolute potential like the giant is like the hyperbolic time chamber we're gonna go in here we're gonna come out with like straight up ssj 92 going into hand of the king how do you get the ability to climb walls that's in slumbering sanctuary so that's another tip for 2bc like 1bc and 2bc players explore like, don't even worry about beating 2BC. Just explore every route. And try to find routes that are more entertaining for you. Try to find routes that feel like that's the right way to go if you are, like, missing gear or you feel weak. 
Um, or if you're super strong, maybe you go a different route instead. You think Giant's too hard for this build? It probably is. It probably is. 100% agree with you. I rolled. I actually wimped out. I'm so sorry, chat. I should have taken the hit. I should have taken the hit. That's the, like, pinnacle spot. Ow. Alright, let's... Alright, let's do it. Go for this hand. Look at the damage. I want to apply Hokuto. Crap, I should have committed. Look at the damage. Is that legal? Alright. That's fine. Look at that. Yo. A little silly. A little silly. I don't know about that one right there, everybody. I don't know if that's legal. Um, so these... You can't activate... I'll show you. You actually cannot activate Last Ring Aura during the spin. It actually interrupts. So you don't take that. You may as well just run the owl. Some... Some big thinkies going on right here. Kushi? Kushi, I thought you were going to bed. Or were you just going to get some food? Don't tell the devs, by the way. <laughs> the devs don't want you to... Don't want to know about this. This is a... Me and chat. You all don't say a word. Hush is the word. Mum's the word. Y you don't want this getting out. Imagine the masses out there all spinning. You don't want everyone spinning. We'll keep this as a collective thing. That's it. You feel like this should be fine given that the weapon's not going to be a lot of people's hands. That's true. I just feel like, when do you not take this? I feel like you only not take, and again, we were talking about the tier list. So we were saying like, can it, can we get some spoilers on the 1.4 tier list? And no spoilers, like you won't get a spoiler out of me. But this thing I was thinking about as like a curse sword, where it's fun for like fun builds or it might be fun for like a little while and then you actually have to get rid of it. I don't think that's the case anymore. I think this thing is 100% again, not to spoil. So if you're if you don't want to hear tier list in-game spoilers, cover your ears now. Um I'll do like a hand motion like remove when we're done. But I actually think this is a straight S. I don't think you don't pick this up. Green, red, as long as it's not nerfed out of being melee. I think as long as this thing's melee, you take it every single time. You only drop it once you get to the final boss. But even then, oh no, you, you have to drop it for the final boss. That's right. You actually have to drop it. But before that, like, why would I not take this on green or red? Because I want cells? <laughs> What's a cell? Look at this. Look at me, like, kill enemies through the wall. No malaise taken just then either, which is nice. Hmm. Ah, oh, man. Way too many dead ends on these maps. No combo.
There we go. Sometimes you have to jump straight up. Shoot, I may as well just spin through the whole map. And then I can fight everybody later. I'm gonna go right into this. <laughs> okay, that's... Uh-uh. That was bad. Don't do that, chat. Don't go into the enemy. Babley. Babley, Babley, let it rip. Was there spikes there? Did anybody see spikes? Asking for a friend. Oh no, it's a dead end. Crap. Okay, I think I actually have to drop out. Uh, which is fine. Yeah, I rallied the entire... Nasty. Sick. Illegal. 18 plus right now. This is some not safe for life gameplay. For mature audiences only. Wait, what? Is this thing actually busted? I think... No spoilers. No tearless spoilers, people. It's strong, though. Seems strong. You can actually pick stuff up. You aren't actually locked out of picking up items. You just can't roll. Hello? And you can't go up. Up is like your only weakness. get this scroll. <laughs> this is, uh... Okay, so, slasher. We're actually gonna fight a slasher elite. So I think if there's anything that can actually break through this build, it might be the slasher. Okay. <laughs> Oh no, my only weakness. Jeez. Imagine having to actually walk. Flawless victory. He, he got spun on. What am I, what can I say? Of course, it's really tough to get a V.60 with this build. Maybe that's the true balance. The true balance is you're not allowed to get B.60s. Because you're like running through spikes and stuff. Oh, is this guy legit? Wow, triple? Oh, you can sell too? Huh. Do you think this could be a speedrun tech? Um, so the only thing about speedrunning is that most of the speedruns are done on zero BC. And if you look, I've burned through a lot of cells. I'm sitting on 159. And I am just spamming. What's V.60? Can you want to help him out or her? Show Ventus the uh, the V.60. You can also do exclamation point BTTV to see the uh, the V.60. It's an emo. That's what it is. It's, it's an emo. Yeah, there is an effect in the game. Freshly is right. <laughs> it does tie into the game a little bit. <clears throat> But we actually made a uh, 
an emote for it. <coughs> wow. Oh, I missed Ramus? I actually walked right by it. So hey, because this is melee, does Ramus reflect? If Ramus doesn't reflect this thing, I would say maybe busted. You look. <laughs> That's his name. Oh, I was on the wrong side. He actually spawned on the other side, like facing me. Unlucky. Okay. Goodbye, Ramus. I'm sorry, Vincis. Here you go. Appreciate the golden outfit with the OP spin. That was not done on purpose. Totally not on purpose. See, I'm supposed to be using the Hokuto to speed this up. I'm like not. Okay, so that will stop you. I think that's fair. All right. I think we're done. Oh. Commence the spinning. Oh, we got a V. <laughs> we still got the V.60. Okay. Wow. Okay, surely Hand of the King can do something about this. Now his his crony, his little baby, his clone can't stop the spin. Let me through. Um, I'm confused. What's going on that's allowing me to spin? It's the weapon. It's my R2 button. Wow, we're getting all kinds of stuff. Okay. Should probably have taken that. But I'll actually just use the boomerang for a little longer. I think I'm running out of cells, to be honest. You feel like this game would be fun with the arcade cabinet? There is someone who plays this game with a fight stick. Someone in chat. I forget who it was. But there is someone that plays with a fight stick. Oh, what's the name of the weapon? Uh, right there. Danny Lion. Freshly was actually right. Uh, so that is the actual name of the weapon. The Syringe. This game's amazing. I would definitely agree. I can't wait to die. Like, there's... Something is gonna kill us like this. There's no way we get out of this alive. I kind of want to see what's there. I kind of want to leave too. We're full HP. Any other fighting is kind of overkill. Wormets. I think the owl's better. 
Like you imagine like dropping Wormettes and then you start spinning. But technically like I have an owl. Hand the King would destroy the Wormettes anyway. So I think the owl's fine. And he's probably gonna destroy my owl too. But hey, for once, I'm the main character, not the owl. Chat. Yo, Freshly, what with the what Twitch happened? Prime sub. Thank you, Freshly. Get some hype in here, some power for Freshly. Getting the fireworks on camera. For those who haven't seen a sub in Dead Cells, it does this. Where the dude dances. Wow, these are some real items. Thank you for that. We're actually, we're three subs away from a new emote. So the new emote's gonna be V.F, actually. So once we hit the 50 subs, you all will be able to spam F. And get ready to spam F right now, as a matter of fact. Because there's no telling how this fight's going to be. This is my first time ever, like, having a straight game with this weapon. Yeah, super cute. They did a really good job with stuff like integration. All right. We do want to land the Hokuto before we start spinning. There we go. Wow, I actually rolled. No, don't kill it, Owl, please. Let's wait. Wait eight seconds, Owl. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna be getting- oh wow, I can't even control my character. So now we're gonna be taking hits. Rip no hit. Ow. So, okay, Hand of the King can kind of- Hand the King can kind of fight you. He was actually, like, contesting me a little bit. You need this for 2BC? A. Hey, out. Let me know. We can sneak one over to you. <laughs> Slide one under the table. One, one syringe under the table. That's not illegal. Drop a syringe in your back pocket. That sounds perfectly legal. No suspicious activity over here, officer. My only problem with this game is the lack of biome diversity. The outside biomes all look the same. And yeah, when you're playing, like... Thinking about from like a speedrunner standpoint, imagine like you're playing Super Mario Brothers as an official speedrunner. You're gonna be seeing the same map over and over, and the same music over and over again. So from Dead Cells perspective, it helps when you have like new creatures. So even though the stuff looks the same, when you start going like to higher difficulties, you start getting new enemies on the same maps. So that gives like a little fresh air so you start off with just Zombos and Pink Guys, then you get the Knife Thrower, then you get the Bomber, then you get Bombardiers, then you get Failed Experiments, all on the first map. So I actually think they did a good job on that. Like, I'm sure they could do something cool, like with filters, like higher difficulties, the first maps, like Red or something. 
or even just colorize. I don't know. I'm sure they got stuff. We're spinning though. Oh, I didn't call the owl. Let's cancel. <laughs> You're fiending. When you guys see me like picking at myself, you know. B's gotta lay off the syringe. We gotta get him back on double owl. Back where it's safe. Double owl is like the the safe version. Okay. So there's a lot of verticality to this map. So I feel like we're going to end up canceling a lot of spins. Wow. <laughs> I didn't really mean to come down here. Apparently we needed to come down here, so it works out. Um... I'm going to look at melee. Because I'm not sure if this boomerang is enough to kill the final boss. Some community shared custom runs that'll make it fresher. That's kind of cool. I almost feel like that's something that you could get from a Discord as well. Like, hey, what's some of you guys' favorite custom runs? Kind of a cool community thing right there. Yeah, this map's a little tough to navigate while spinning. Just to say that. Dude, imagine if I actually got a blueprint. Ever. Imagine V.me actually getting a blueprint. That's crazy. It's crazy, right? Come on. I think I actually have to cancel. <laughs> Tell Nintendo to give us a Dead Cells Maker. I, not to say I don't have any imagination. I would be like kind of embarrassed to show you guys my levels in Dead Cells. If it had something like that. some damage that really hurt leap of faith go up I'm like kind of low on cells in my opinion, so I'm trying my best to like really save. Trying to save some money. Save some cells. Oh cool. Um... We might be able to spin the whole way. Uh, let's let it go through. I mean, I'm saving cells for my weapon. I'm actually feeding cells to this syringe to spin. It's a battery. The cells are the juice. <laughs> Shack with the flex. Talking about hemorrhage. What's that? Never heard of it. I 
I need a new skill. I just realized. Oh no! No! Okay, we're good. Um, I, I kind of. Oh, I already have damage resistance, seventy-five percent to range. So I think we're good. Trying to thin your homie javelin. It's fun. I'm not gonna say it's like a, a bad weapon and you should never take it. I just mean that you should plan to get rid of it at some point. Unless it's busted. Unless you have the busted javelin, plan to get rid of it eventually. Is there anything there? I don't think so. Did we finish? No. Yes. I'm just gonna go down there. Just see if I left anything at the very bottom. Alright. We're good. We can actually climb tower now. Be busted. Be not busted item. That could be another emo. Buster saying busted. Wow, by money. Ah, uh, that sucks. So as far as the final boss goes, I'm not like super worried. But there's definitely a high chance that this like square button isn't gonna cut it on the boss. It deals bonus damage at full HP. I feel like if it did like poison one touch combined with the double ammo. Ooh. I screwed that all up. My bad, chat. I didn't mean to just take all that damage. Hate these things. Um, so we didn't see a food shop. So I will actually drink the health pot. So we're only gonna have one health pot for the final boss. Which I'm pretty much okay with. Obviously two would have been nicer. This is also like kind of awkward. Spinning here. Oh wow. How in the world did I not make that jump? I gotta learn it. You can make that. That is not that high. Alright. Let's... Yeah, just peter out. Buy a refill? I don't think we had a food shop. It's actually surprisingly random. So we have... I think it's range and melee. Yeah, skill. I'm sorry. Skill and melee. Which means I actually need a replacement. Which I would like it to be... Last Ring Aura? No, I think I need a turret. Grenade. Bleeding. I think I want flame turret. Yeah. 
Or I could go cleave. Damage reduction when you're near it. That's funny. I have to reset it, though, if I take that. This is... Holy crap, this thing's massive. Generates a toxic cloud around it. Bonus damage to poison target. Okay. But yeah, just to show you, it's melee weapons. So yeah, I wish I could just buy the refill, but it's not happening. And again, I'm kind of okay. Like, I don't mind the one health pot super much. Of course, it would have been nice to have two. That's all. Let's see what else we can drag down. I want the bird. Doesn't look like I'm allowed to have it, though. See, what sucks is that I actually have lifesteal. And I should really be trying to figure out how to lifesteal. Yeah, that's fine. All right, so now we have to fight these two things. Uh, I will do the strat. I'm gonna eat that infected food for sure. All right, so let's activate the owl, aggro, syringe. Okay. The other one just died. How in the world did it die? Okay. I'll take it. Little freebie. Elevator stomp? Maybe. It, it just vanished. There were two. So for those who didn't see, there's two. One of them died from the fall. The other one just died on its own. Like, it lost the will to live after its loved one perished. Feels bad. See, that's when you need a V.F. V.F. The, uh, pecker. Alright, so we're taking... We're actually gonna drop syringe. We're actually going to drop the syringe. Sell this. Interesting. I can't... No, they got to let me use it. Imagine if it doesn't let me use those two. There's no way. Are you kidding me? Huh. You actually can't go to zero. It let me use one as soon as I'm gonna spam it. So last try. I'm gonna spam R2. What happens if I do? I don't know. I don't know. That's why we're, we want to find out. This is also, for those who don't know, the V.me stream is also an experimental stream. We like to test stuff out. 
Mm -mm. I wonder why it let me use one when I had two, and now when I have one, I can't. Very interesting. All right. So we're pretty much done here. Um... I am gonna reset. Final build is probably Vengeance, Dead Inside, Triage. Only because I only have one health pot I can use, so I kinda have to make it count. And I know Triage makes the health pot less, like, less powerful, but you don't wanna fail the health pot either. If I failed it, then we, like, auto-lose. Okay. So, Vengeance. Dead Inside. I could also go Recovery here. Recovery lets the Boomerangs heal me. Uh, but I do think it's gonna be Triage. Just so we we really don't want an error to happen. This is all just error prevention. Uh, you assume it's made for you not to do that. Don't have to kill stuff for keys. That's forcing you to take the orbs. And so I'm really bad and I always think that the devs forget stuff. I always think, oh, here's a detail that there's no way the devs thought of this. But apparently, you can't reduce yourself to zero. I also should have, um... So my bad, I'm actually playing on 5 cell. I do like to tell you all that um, this is kind of a spoiler fight. If you don't want to see this, if you don't want to see like the cutscenes after, now's the time for you to cover your eyes, cover your ears. You can probably come back in like three minutes. It's usually a quick fight, um, but if you don't want like story spoilers, now's the time to back out. Uh, I'll give everybody like a good 10 seconds. Either way, I do hope everyone's having a good night tonight. Again, I don't normally stream past 10 30. I'm only doing that tonight because my wife has not left. No, I think she did leave work, so she'll probably be home soon. But I decided to uh, just have like a longer night if she's gonna be out. He took a crap ton and I only had one. Rip immersion. <laughs> That's, we gotta report that one. You all definitely gotta change the animation right here. That one cell was infinite as shown from- Hey, that's a good point. Loses food? That's a good point. We could not use this- I mean, we could use the syringe as much as we want, and it wouldn't take the last one. This is good damage. This isn't bad at all. Like, look at the boomerang go. I should be using my head on it too. Wait, already? Huh? Did we skip a phase, chat? He only... He only healed himself once. 
Uh. Hello? What have we done? <laughs> no. So syringe is infinite on the last biome. I don't know. I, maybe we could have gone to zero in Hand of the King. I don't. I honestly don't know. That's my first time ever even trying to go to zero with that item. I think that's the fastest way, the fastest fight I've ever had against this guy with the no hit. Owl's still here. Owl never left. Owl is impressed. This is the first time the owl actually got impressed. We went to the room once, Shaq. Oh, because of no cells? Ooh, that's the secret tech. The secret technology. If you lose all your cells, he can only drink once. Kushi Matama breaking the magician's code right here. How do you how can you do that, Kushi? It's supposed to keep it hush. Play with Hand the King outfit, please. This is definitely my last one. It's super bedtime. We're all in deep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get, <laughs> he can't be talking about get good. When we got the syringe, this actually might be my personal best, to be honest. This may have been the fastest run I've done in five cell. Oh, it's still an hour. Never mind. That wasn't fast at all. Maybe we took like way too much time talking. The Panacea. Yo, let's go. Streak at two. <laughs> Would definitely be interesting to see another run with no cells and see if it's just as fast. There's just not enough cells to feed the um syringe. That's the problem, is that in zero cell, you don't get that many cells. So you can't feed the syringe with it. Spoilers, hey, you, you all weren't supposed to be watching. Now you can, now you can watch. If you're doing this, now you can watch. You're back. Welcome back, everybody. I'm V.Me. We just beat the final boss. Um, cool stuff. Big ups to the developers, big ups to everyone involved. We actually had a brand new build that apparently is kind of strong. Just to say that, I think it's kind of strong. No spoilerinos, but I think that might be on the S tier. I don't know. You all tell me. If you think that's an S tier, I won't, I won't argue with you. That's your words, not mine.